treatment or management, we care for our patients, okay? And that's what it's about. And if you think about it, 90% of the time we're providing reassurance. We rule out the heart attack, we rule out the C spine injury, or whatever it may be. We're providing reassurance, we're there for them. And I won't detail it with you, but if you ever get a chance, uh, look up a painting called The Doctor by Sir Luke Fields, an uh, Irish painter in, in, 19, in 1892. It's in, the, in fact, the, the doctor is hanging in the uh, Tate Gallery in London, and you can probably look it up. But th what's cool is that you see the, the distraught parents in the background. This is 1890. There's probably nothing they can do for this very sick child. And yet, and the doctor's sitting there with his hand on his chest and my uh, hand on his chin, and uh, my interpretation is a couple things. One, he's researching. He says, is there anything else I haven't thought of here that I could do? And secondly, the doctor is just there, you know, in the middle of the night. And so um, I'm very proud because I'm going to run a big meeting next year in Florida, and we are going to entitle it First There, First Care. So for those of you who do, uh, on the front lines, uh, like just keep that in mind. That's sort of my philosophy, and we'll move on from here. Okay. So that's what got me on the streets. So when I got recruited to uh, Houston, the next thing I know is they said they wanted me to run the ICUs there, and uh, someone had said, "Hey, but can you help us set up our EMS system a little bit over the next few years?" And long and short of it, um, I uh, just got sort of suckered into it. And but it ended up being an incredibly great experience because of the research that we cranked out over the next little while. You'll hear about some of that as we get out with this. All right, let's see how am I doing. I only got five minutes left right now. Yeah. <laughs> after, 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 I, after that rambled on. So, anyways, so I started off as an ICU guy, and then people like Dr. Cobb and Cocos uh, recruit me in to go into the streets. So here I am, and I was out there teaching them like their pulmonary stuff and so on. Um, but one of the things I, I, I went to the meeting of the Society for Fairness the last time I talked there was in 1983, I think it was. Yeah, it was evolving. Why am I? Why was I in the street? Because I said the earlier the intervention, the better results. Can anybody give me a good example of that? By the way, we were talking about it earlier today. 